Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Ecliptic Spiritualist channel. I'm Ranita, and we are doing our Bay Leaf Wish Spell today on this Sunday, uh, June the um, 14th. And the energy that we want to be um, mm -hmm. really working on and burning for, for us to build up some areas is lining up with <clears throat> a lot of the retrogrades that are going on right now, especially the energy that is being posed to us and those energies all about self and dealing with some energies that we're going to be burning on that's concerning us which will be self-identity we're going to be burning for <clears throat> self-conditioning another area we're burning on is self self-reflection and last but not least is self-love dignity self-dignity now why are we burning on this Sunday using our gold candle that represents the sign abundance abundance prosperity well these are some areas that do deal with a lot of abundance and as you burn in reference to that you will have that energy overflow for you so you want to make sure when we're dealing with self care dignity reflection um, conditioning is dealing with keeping promises to yourself um always making sure that you know that you are good enough not complaining about self um do things that are great for yourself and pushing this improvement because as we are in today's world <clears throat> today's world is taking a very deep reflection of itself as we grow and go into this new age of Aquarius, this golden age, this age of revolution of self, self-thinking and awakening, self-improvement is a very important area we're burning and bringing in this psychedelic energy that will be courageous enough to shift your energy, your perspective of yourself. Now, if this doesn't uh, resonate with you, it will resonate with someone else that you know, so you can burn for them. Or you can burn for the world's energy that's going on and where this lies within our global situation as of today, as of this 14th of June, 2020. So as I was guided to do that, so let's get it in. All right. So with this one, we're dealing with self-identity. Um, okay. So we're going to burn for self-identity, knowing who we truly are. A lot of people struggle in that area of self-identity because they were told to do something or be this person their entire life or was put into them even generationally and have they truly found themselves. That goes into shadow work. We will be working in the area of shadow work coming in the fall in a class setting so stay tuned for that so the next one is um self-conditioning self-conditioning sending this energy of self-conditioning of abundant self-conditioning in our mind and what all promises we've made to ourselves and how important it is for self-conditioning that you could be all that you want to be if you program yourself with the self conditioning. You have to program yourself. All right. Now, this other one is about self reflection. Self reflection. You see where to go? Self reflection. Reflection time. Reflection time, making us dig deep in ourselves and, and how we view the world and our perspective. Are we open to the energy that is going on today and not the ideology that has been programmed in a lot of people and not having a worldwide vision or thought of balance and self-work and self-reflection of where we truly are globally and in our own selves how we're reflecting our own beliefs, sending this energy out. The next one is self-dignity. Self-dignity. 
have a lot of love on this area because self-dignity is so important. Self-dignity. Hmm. Keeping promises to yourself. Knowing that you're beyond good enough. All right? And there we go. So we have our areas there that we're working on on this day, on this Sunday, the 14th. Have a wonderful burn, our bay leaf wish spell burn. It does change your life. You can burn as much as you like. What do we do with the ashes? You can make black salt out of it. You can blow the ashes in the wind. You can add the black salt. I'm sorry, to the black ashes to your bath. Put it in your bath. Uh, it's very biogradable, so you can use it in any way you like, okay? So in saying that, I love you for watching today. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe the videos on Instagram, Twitter, and um, Facebook, and YouTube. I will see you next time. Don't forget that we offer a personal readings and so much more. See you later. Bye-bye.